Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Two Point Hospital. There is a nurse who's actually got treatment two, plus they've got ward management as well. That nurse would be really good if I had the money to hire them. They would, they would genuinely be good. Uh, you've also got treatment skills, but you don't have what I want. There is a doctor kicking around. Okay, first up, let's go into loans. I am able to take a $50,000 loan right there. That is going to allow me to go into hire and take that nurse right there. Gregory Spong. Will work for peanuts. Has boycotted bungled products for environmental reasons. Right, you can go in here somewhere. I don't really care where you go. I just want to add you into the labor pool so that you can help out. And then I've got more people who can train up in ward management level two, which would be really, really useful. Uh, but now I want to go to staff, doctor, uh, jobs list over here. You, where are you at the moment? Fro uh, Frobisher Bilge. Staff overview. Frobisher Bilge working in a GP's office. Well, I don't want you working in a GP's office. You're not suited to that job. You're not eminently suited because you don't have anything to do with the treatment or anything else. So for a minute, I will allow you to work in the shock treatment, but you're also you're going to be working in the DNA lab. I want you in the DNA lab. So that should shuffle him around a little bit and get him up where he belongs. Uh, eight nurses over here. So we've now got three nurses who have this. Looking for work. Working in the fracture ward. Not sure I want you working. I've got three nurses who now are able to work in a ward. So you are only allowed to work in a ward. And then you down here. So actually what I want to do is anyone that doesn't have ward management... I won't allow them to work in the ward. And you here, I'm thinking... You can work in the others, but I'm not going to allow you to work in the ward. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to stop you from working in the ward. But I'll allow you to work in the others. Yeah, see, you could do with either ward management... Well, ward management 2 on these three characters right here. You're not ready for ward management 2 yet. But the other two are. Not allowed to work in that ward. And the same with this ward over here. You are not, you are not, and you are not. So I've only got three people that can work in those wards. So they are able to go and work elsewhere. But that will help things along a little bit. We'll have the right nurses working in the fracture wards. Look, see, he's coming out, and I got the right one coming in. Maintenance required in the clown this clinic. This is Ricky Hawthorne on Two Point Radio. I'm sure you've heard of smoking food, but have you heard of smogging food? It's all the rage down in, you guessed it, smogly. While it may be an acquired taste, if I've learned anything about food over the years, it's that acquired tastes are always the fanciest, and therefore, the best. Okay. Well done, we successfully completed the request from Kylie Tiger. Challenge earned 100,000, so we get 20% additional happiness and some K points. At the moment, the Mono Beasts thing is uh, Mono Brow infections. I still have yet to find one. Staff promotion right there. We've got Junior Nurse up to Nurse. That's good, because that gives them additional treatment skills and things like that, which might help out... Just improve the situation all the way round. General practice is nearly finished over there. I'm going to wait until this is finished before I... Required in reception. I've got a failure there. It's still yet to see. I'm sure that the mono beasts are just like... They, they look like mice. Pretty sure I have seen one once. But that was it. Whether I'll ever see another one, I don't know. General Practice 2 has finished training. Once this is done, I've got In Progress 3. Cured 3, failed 2. Let's go a little bit faster. Like that. As Doctor soon as that's done, then I'll do the research. ward management. Doctor required in research. I have yet to see... Ooh. 
That one's working. Right. Let's go to normal speed here. I've got three failed and three cured for that one. I want to see this one working. I want to see the heel elixir over here. What are we treating in here? So you are going to step onto the plate right there. What have you got? Diagnosis. Oh. I want to see treatment. I mean, that does look pretty cool. You're not supposed to be treating people. Diagnosis plus 25%. You're supposed to be treating... You, you, you're supposed to be treating people in there. With the whole denim thing. Staff promotion. I got a janitor now who's able to be promoted. So we will promote you like that. Now, um, there's a queue outside the GP's office. Yeah, we're probably going to need to upgrade the GP's office pretty soon. One in progress in here. There is a monobrow patient. There's the monobrow patient that we're looking at. And that looks like a failure. Special report. You cured five out of eight patients. Well done. We cured, so we get ten grand for that. That's put us... Ooh, we're exactly 100,000 now. Okay, now that's done, I'll then move over to here. And it's ward management level two that I want to do next. Right there. I've got two trainees available for this. So we will take both of those. Trainer available. He will come in from outside and start training. So there's that bit underway. Excellent. That is almost done. The, the fluids one right there is almost done. I want some... I'm probably going to want more rooms. These aren't using. Right. Awards countdown. Let's quickly do our awards. Open all. Let's not worry about them. Uh, so I got Rising Star three times. Last one by Kylie Tiger. Uh, Employer of the Year. So they're all very happy with their best teaching hospital. We got again. Uh, best research hospital. We got again. Hospital of the Year. Awarded to the winningest hospital of the year because they need more awards. Most prestigious. We've got that once. That's the nicest working environment. Patient's choice. Uh... Treatment, success, and reputation, and no deaths. I've never, ever won the no deaths thing. <laughs> it says a lot about me, is I've never won the, the no deaths. In the, hospital. the, no, that's the extractor pan, the deluxe thing. Deluxe, oh, lux, I'm now able to upgrade that one, so I will get a janitor in to upgrade that one for us a minute. Uh, treatment is underway over there. Let's rush this along. I had 100,000 just now. That's really lowered down now. I got a Maintenance ghost over there. Bins will become full. Ah! These! These people over here! I'm waiting for a... Uh, I'm waiting uh, for a doctor to come back. The bug, that ten-legged wonder, the crown jewel of our county's waters. There's something so captivating about a crustacean that you can share amongst a table of five. The shells are incredibly useful, of course. I have one at my home that I use as a rather tasteful fruit bowl. Okay. Uh, denim jeans. Denim jeans, I it could have cured him over here, but the doctor was sat in here in the canteen instead of actually doing some treatment work. Research project completed, fluid analysis. We are now able to do a fluid analysis thing. Uh, rival executive and CEO of Bungles, Sophie Nova, has informed us that she'll be visiting the hospital for inspiration soon. If she's impressed with the hospital, she might share some information that could help our research department. Challenge, impress the VIP with a nice hospital. Research team has designed the ideal machine to extract fluids from patients whilst causing maximum pain. <laughs> whilst causing maximum pain. Rewards? Fluid analysis. Okay, so we've got a fluid analysis room. I've got a couple of rooms. We haven't got a cardiology room yet. Um, I've got one psychiatry room. I'm not doing marketing at the moment. We've got the cafe up and running. A pan's lab clown clinic and all of those the injection I haven't built the injection room yet which I should do I have got that one but fluid analysis down here high-tech diagnosis extracts fluids for analysis and sometimes for fun a three by three room right I can put a three by three room I think I can actually put one in over here so we can put fluid analysis in this room right here one two three there we go that is going to be the perfect spot for fluid analysis 
And then I will put that one over in the corner there. This thing looks pretty monstrous, to be honest. And we will put a bin over here. We will put in an extinguisher. We will put in some hand sanitizer. We will put in a radiator. Uh, we will put in a plant. Over there, we will get a chair for our doctor to sit on. Or nurse, or whoever it is that's going to be running this contraption. And we will put a Jasmine Odyssey picture on the wall, because everybody loves Jasmine. And we're going to put a swirly poster on the wall as well, and that is done. Right, we've got fluid analysis. Excellent. You require a nurse. So we want to go to higher over here, and we want to find another nurse. I've got an injection there. Uh, ward management, who's av immediately available for more training. You... no. Diagnostics. Okay, I will take you. Charming, will work for peanuts, but also lazy. Uh, we'll take you anyway. Right, you can go into there. I could probably do with another doctor, to be honest. What about you? Happy, energized. He's the only doctor that can work in the DNA lab. It's currently on a break. Another four days. So I'm waiting for him to come over here. I could do with another doctor that can work in the DNA lab, really, couldn't I? So let's go and have a look at these doctors available. Uh, those are research doctors. I've got a bedside manner, treatment skill. You don't have any... You've got an additional... Except that's wasted, because that's research. And I've already got a research doctor. I suppose an extra psychiatrist wouldn't hurt. And also that as well. And then I could train her in the DNA research. So if I was to take her, girl next door... Target of unrequited idolization isn't holding their breath. So I'm going to dump you in there like that. I got 31,000. Let's go fast speed. I will allow that one to keep working through. You in here, I need to select a project. Those are all 2,000 points. General research, I don't want I don't want that. Training research there. I'd like to... I would like to do that. I would like to be able to bump that one out. So I'm going to start that project there. Training research. I'm going to want to use that training research pretty soon. This one's got six days left, and then we'll train a couple of doctors in DNA research if we can. If we've got that available, that would be really, really awesome. We have a VIP visiting the hospital. Uh, right, where's my ghost janitor? I need a ghost janitor. Because I don't want the VIP. Oh, I got another ghost over here. How many ghosts have we got? I got a lot of dead people. I see dead people everywhere. Uh, you, right, you are a ghost janitor. So start off with, we'll bring you over here, clean up litter, capture a ghost. Right, capture that ghost. There. Now take you down over here. Oh, I can't. Captured. Now I can take... There we go. Now I can take you and I can bring you down over this way. Where's that other ghost gone? There's another ghost around here somewhere. There it is. And are you going to get the ghost? Yes. Right. He's got the ghost. Uh, staff challenge. Get a level four staff room. Right, I can do that. I just got to wait until I've got a little bit of cash available to actually do it. I'm doing all right for cash. I mean, yes, I am minus eight grand right now, but we've got a lot more coming in because I've got so many different treatment rooms. The treatment is finished over here, so I've now got level two working on there. This is going to get me uh, 10,000 for treating there. 9,900. Let's go into here. I need, what do they say? A level four staff room, current level three. So we're going to go to you, and we're going to edit this room like this. And then we're going to need to make this room look absolutely wonderful. So first up, we will go for a rug. That is $300. Okay, rugs definitely help. Uh... And I can do it like that. I put a rug there. 
and a rug there. And a rug there. One. And I can put another rug over here. So I've got rugs all over the floor. There. That's pretty much put me up to the, the full <laughs> requirement that I needed. I don't need any more than that. Uh, wicker chairs and things like that I'm not going to worry about. So we'll put a Jasmine Odyssey picture on the wall. Because there are a few people that really like Jasmine Odyssey. And we'll put a gold record over in the corner. And there we go with a level 4 room. Excellent. fan schmastic. Uh, plus 25% happiness and 10k points. So there's that bit done. I want a mono beast. Has anybody seen any mono beasts? I've yet to see a mono beast. We've seen the DNA thing working a little bit. I got another ghost over there. Warning. Try not to slip in the sick. But I haven't yet seen a I've seen this one being used for diagnosis, but I haven't seen this one being used for treatment yet. Uh, like the the actual denim thing. Ah there, look, denim, right there. Okay. You. You are a appointment in fluid analysis. There's fluid analysis. I, we can have a look at the fluid analysis thing. This is designed to cause maximum pain. That's what they said. Let's slow that down a little bit. Uh, what's he doing? <laughs> okay, that looks like kind of um, freaky. He now needs a drink. Attention. Urinating anywhere in the hospital will not be tolerated. Right, there's Beatrice Rake. She's going in for her appointment, so... They put their arm into the machine. Oh, no, she spat into the little golden bowl first. Now... <laughs> I didn't realise it was needles and everything. Look at it. <laughs> oh, oh, that's brilliant. That's absolutely fantastic. That was absolutely brilliant. Right. You now, you are still diagnosis is required. Staff promotion, I need another promotion right there. Promote. Uh, she's rushing off to the toilets. Right. I need to deal with these ghosts. And also I could do with someone else being treated on here. But there's our hex machine running again. It is pretty cool, this hex machine. It's very futuristic, this one. Yeah. Okay, I don't know what he just did. Diagnosis plus 31%. Doctor to the Deluxe Clinic. Diagnosis required. Okay, we've got... There's a, there's 12 people in the queue for the GP's office. That's something that we... All right, I've got 28,000 now. So if I go to here... Uh, general practice. Ward management... Genetics was the next one that I wanted to train, wasn't it? So that I've got some additional doctors that can work there and I can spread the doctors out a little bit. Trainers available. We'll go with you. And here, I want doctors that can do it. So that is treatment level two. You can go in. And you right here, your psychiatry and treatment level one. So you're just kind of a general treatment. Uh, I can't afford that. I can afford to train one doctor with it. All right, well, I'll do that then. I will train one doctor in that one. And then we'll worry about... Good gravy. That just, wa that just walloped down to 58. Good job I took that when I did. Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to afford another one. Very, very good job. Right, I've got cues. I've got lots of cues outside of all of the GP's offices. So I think that our next step is going to be... Oh, wow. In today's technology news, there's been a medical breakthrough in one of our hospitals. Research has been completed on a fluid accelerator, which is sure to speed up recovery for all those suffering from fluid-related maladies. A fluid accelerator? Okay. There's been an outbreak of shock horror after a bungle experiment accidentally set an electric sent an electric current through all of the county spoons. <laughs> there's a group of yogurt eaters looking for tree. <laughs> We'll be rewarded if we treat if we treat this guy. <laughs> Should we have them sent here? Hey, yeah, bring him in. Are on the way. Bring him in. Bring him in. Why not? Okay, he's cold. I don't know why he's cold. Shouldn't be cold over here. There's some um, heaters. 
Hang on a minute. Oh, I've, I've got no money. I need to wait until I got some money, and then I can... Uh, one thing I'm going to do is I need an additional GP's room, because look, this is ridiculous. The, the, the queues that I've got for people here, I could do with an additional assistant as well. Um, I've got a warning right there. An additional janitor. Looks like it's about time I got another janitor. Janitor needed to repair discharger. Oh, wow. Janitor needed over there. Janitor needed in here. Fire in the hospital. Thought you ought to know. You, this is why we put the fire extinguisher in every room. Did you work? Yes, that worked. Right, publicity update. Let's go to normal speed on there. Sophie Nova has sent us a email to thank us and say that her visit was has given us some exciting ideas. Bungle is sending us a little of their recent research. Just what we needed, I think. We gained 250 research points. Okay, ideal. Our docs have discovered a new illness, Litterbug, a bacterial infection that causes a sufferer to discard items at random. If the patient is seeking treatment, we will need an injection room. Uh, get the patient to wait. I am minus 50,000. I need an injection room. I think I've run out of money, though. <laughs> Just a little bit. Just a little bit run out of money. Um, we're going to have to earn the money the old-fashioned way. Then we can build an injection room. I also want another GP's office. Uh, the, we're doing all right. I, I still haven't cured any patients in my DNA lab. I've got the DNA lab here, and I've yet to cure a single patient in it. Maintenance required in shop clinic. The discharger is really not looking as healthy as it could, which is a slight problem considering all of the people. All right, excuse Attention. me. Urinating. Anywhere in the hospital will not be tolerated. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at that money. Suddenly come up. Uh, yeah, uh, the, the discharger is really not looking as healthy as it could, which is a slight problem considering all of these people who are waiting to go in here. If we could get them to come in here pretty quick, that would be awesome. So if you can hurry up and repair that one. Then we should be able to get a bit more money. We've got $8,000 now. It's coming up. We've got this one working over here. I really like this thing. I think this thing looks really cool. The Helixer. I also think that we need to get our janitors trained a little better. And I've probably got enough janitors at the moment. Let's get a training course going. Anyway, we, we've got a lot of staff that are available to do things. I got four for diagnostics. Um, we've got injection administration. We've got three available. Ghost capture. I've got two trained in ghost capture. Mechanics, two. Now, that would be pretty good. Enhance up 50% upgrade skill. Uh, maintenance, two. I think that would be a better one. And maintenance, two. That will plus 30% maintenance skill. They should be able to repair things faster. I don't know if that means that they keep hold of the whole training thing, uh, if they keep hold of it a little bit better. Treatment 2. Oh, maybe this, this this might be an interesting one. Treatment 2. Right, Dr. Plaggy, Pe uh, Plaggy Plum. Uh, Pe Pe Peggy Plum. Treatment with a doctor right there. Okay, she, definitely that one. Nurse Dottie Marinade over there. She's working in fluid analysis. That's diagnostics in fluid analysis. I think we could go with diagnostics with her rather than treatment. Uh, Asquith Dump, chief nurse. She would be pretty good as a treatment too, I think, because that would also help pharmacy management as well. I'm sure of it. So we'll add her in. And also the nurse there. But this nurse here, I'm going to go with diagnosis skills. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Um... What's the diagnosis like? Courses available. Diagnos Diagnostics 2. I've only got two trainees available for that. That is the nurse there that is available. And also that other nurse. Do I want better diagnostics or do I want better treatment staff with this qualifier? I've got nine of them. I don't think I need to worry about Diagnostics 2. I don't think that is going to help a huge amount. I think treatment would be better. I think we need to get more people treated. So we will do the treatment thing. 
Except that the only problem with the treatment thing is... I don't have the money for it. Not yet. We're going to have to wait. We're going to have to let that money come up again. If I want to treat four people at once, I need 50 grand to be able to do that. May not have 50 grand. Right, the discharger is working and this one is working down here. New illness discovered. Head crabbedness. A doctor have discovered a new illness of head crabbedness. The sufferer's head has been seized by a rare form of parasitic crustacean. Unfortunately, treatment is available that wrenches the creature from the victim, leaving their head healthy and uninfested. We'll send the patient for treatment in our deluxe clinic. Ah. Right, well, we need to find that one out. I'm, I'm gonna, I'll have a look at that in a minute. A lot of litter around. Uh, sounded like somebody just died. Right, that one got me five grand for diagnosis in there. 34,000 there, so we've gone back down. I just lost another 50 grand. Hospital is in debt. How much do we get from here? The shock horror treatment. Call what is that getting us each time? Ghost, please. 11,000 for the shock treatment, which is pretty good. A patient is unhappy with the hospital and storming out. It's the ugly environment. I've got to do more to improve the state of the hospital. Right, what about you? What are you doing? You're cured. Right, okay, that's that's good. We have got cured over there. Um, minus 6,000 here. We've got people going on over there. The You've got shock you treatment. To find them. Not as you'd expect to find them. <laughs> Leave toilets as you uh, intend to find them, not as you'd expect to find them. I'm pretty sure she said. Something along those lines. So, yeah, treatment two. I'm also going to want an extra doctor's surgery. I've so many patients waiting. I've got a patient there who's about to keel over. There's not a lot that I can do about that. We're just going to let them keel over. We're sorry for the litter that you dropped on our floor. <laughs> I like that. We're sorry for the litter that you dropped on our floor. Staff training required. Perry Monk has gained lots of experience on the job. They'll be ready for promotion to, uh, to consultant once they've completed some training. A new qualification will give them increased abilities. Train now. Research 3. Dr. Perry Monk is going to have Research 3. I will need that one. That is 25,000 to train him. I gotta get 50,000 to train the other one, so I will do this training right here for Dr. Perry Monk. Start training, and then the research is going to go up by a nice little amount as well. That is going to help us out nicely, I think. That is going to be a good thing. Uh, the other thing that I want to do is... Read the Two Points yeah. Squabbler for all your local news. Two points of view. On all subjects. Because you decide what's true. Serving Two Points County. This is Two Points Radio. Right, I'm now minus 62,000. Doesn't look like I'm going to be copying and pasting that one at the moment. So yes, I will stop editing that room for a minute. We will let this lot keep going. He's tired, he's Boy, going off. That one. not to slip in the sick. That one is working continuously and is doing a good job of it too. He says, as one fails right there. Shock horror treatment. We've got two failed and two cured. We, we still need that to be boosting. A lot of patients are queuing outside rooms that are run by doctors. There aren't any available. We need to hire more doctors. Uh, general diagnose... Uh, di di that one, actually, that one there, that would be a good doctor to take on. Beatrice Dickens. We need to keep an eye on the money. As soon as we've got the money, we will hire Beatrice Dickens. Well, I think that's quite enough care and loving attention inflicted upon the patients from myself for today. So we will return next time. In the meantime, if you have enjoyed this episode, then could you please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.